Hi, my name is Seti and welcome back to another Tips and Tricks with Apps Events and Acer. AppsEvents.com is the place where you can find Tips and Tricks videos just like this one. So let's go ahead and add another one to that list. Today we will be looking at forms and how you can create a pre-filled Google form to share with anyone filling it out. So here, as an example, we'll have a school survey and I want my year seven and year eight students to fill this out. Now, I do want to save them time as they're filling out this form. And so I'm going to generate a pre-filled version of this form and then share that special link with them. So the first form, we're going to pre-fill year seven. And then on the second form, we'll pre-fill the information about which pet they have. Let's go ahead and look at the form. We ask a number of questions. Which year group are you in? What is your schoolhouse? Do you have a pet? And what animal is your pet? We also ask who is your teacher? So let's go ahead and create that pre-filled form. Now, in order to do that, we're going to have to click on the three dots in the top right corner. So clicking on those three dots, an option appears that says get a pre-filled link. This opens a different instance of this form and we are now going to select or input all the answers we want pre-filled. So for that first one, we want to pre-select year seven. We are going to skip the rest and then go all the way down and add in my name as the teacher. We're going to click on get link. This generates a special hyperlink. We can click on copy link and add it to our planning document. This will now pre-fill that form. So now let's create a version where we pre-fill the pet as a dog. So we're going to just close that version there. Click on those three dots, get a pre-filled link. This time, let's not select a year group. Let's skip the house and let's say, yes, I have a pet. It is a dog. And then let's also fill out the teacher's name. Now, again, why do we create these pre-filled forms? because it saves our students, colleagues, or parents a lot of time when filling out forms. I'm going to click on get link. And there we go. We can copy that link and paste it into our document. Now let's make sure that this works and let's open up these pre-filled links. We're going to click on it and let's preview that form. As you can see, year seven is already highlighted and we also have the name of the teacher already filled out. Let's go ahead and test the second one. We're going to click on that link, open the pre-filled link. And as you can see, the fact that they have a pet is already pre-selected. Now they can always manually clear that selection, but this way you're going to save anyone filling out your surveys and forms and assessments a lot of time. I hope you found this helpful. This was another Tips and Tricks with Apps Events and Acer. Make sure to subscribe to the channel or visit our website appsevents.com for even more tips and tricks just like this one. In the meantime, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.